Patriots, are we live? All right, here we go. Medfield Boys Volleyball versus Catholic Memorial. Just got underway here. Uh, that's a nice, uh, nice idea by Nicolata there. A little long. Catholic Memorial takes a 1-0 lead. Let's see if the boys really need this win tonight. Jack Maddie with a nice kill there. Medfield has five games remaining, including this, and they need four wins in order to make the playoffs. So this is, of course, a very big evening for them. Dig by Tom Stevenson and Hunter. Brian Hunter put that away. That's, that looks good. They're going to need more of that tonight and the rest of the season if they're going to go anywhere. Nice setup by the guys. Thomas Stevenson, senior and captain to serve. Midfield up two to one. Nice block there. Uh, double block by uh, Colada and Maddie. Something they've been working on. Three to one midfield. Nice ace serve there by Thomas Stevenson. It's got an interesting serve. It dies just as it goes over the net. So a lot of teams have a hard time hitting it. Mm -hmm. Dug out by Thomas Stevenson and well, oh, unfortunately, the, uh, the set there just hitting the uh, antenna. Ball to Catholic Memorial. We may have an illegal rotation here on midfield. Point to Catholic Memorial for an illegal rotation. And we'll try it again. Boy, oh boy. Some miscommunication there by Medfield. And it's tied 4-4. Okay. They look a little tired. Something's not right on the Medfield side. They're going to have to uh, pick it up here if they want to. Put this one away. Well played by Nick Collada there. Good double block by Collada and Hunter, but uh, out of bounds. And CM will take a two point lead. Falling behind here, seven to four, in the early going here in game number one. Another rotation issue, just as CM hit it into the net there, and he gets another shot at it. Mercifully, the streak ends, and Madfield will take the ball back. Down eight to five. Looks like we've got Randall Miller coming in. Randall's a sophomore. He's got a terrific serve for Medfield. It's been a great addition to the team this year, up from JV from last year. Looks like we've got a little questioning going on at the scorer's table. It's Anna Craw behind the scorer's table. She's uh, obviously a very talented player for the girls' volleyball team. She's been helping out the boys this season. Medfield should get another point there on the point. There it goes, 8-6. Medfield down by two. Randall Miller serving for Medfield. Nice serve by Miller. It's a 
double hit. Miller to serve from that field, down one. Oh, it's a nice spike there by number 19. And Catholic Memorial. And now get the ball back. Medfield needs to make a run here, make a statement in this first game. They do not want to let these guys hang around. That's for sure. This is a game that they should take. Nice play by Brian Hunter to get that one over. Not always easy. Four hits on the Captain Memorial. It was a valiant effort, though. He <laughs> kept the ball alive, but it was four hits at the end. Sean Conroy, first year player, junior, to serve for midfield. Another great addition to the team this year. Randall with the dig, set up. Bobby Hunter, Bobby Hunter, <laughs> Bobby O'Reilly. A nice hit to get that one over there for the win. Nice save by Thomas Stevenson. Hunter with the over there. Nice dig by Miller. Well done by Hunter to get that ball over there at the end. Thomas is set up by Conroy. Amanda Miller with the pass. Up. One of the challenges that uh, Medfield has had this year is when those long spikes. And that's something they're working on. Good serve. Well played by Carger there just to get it over. Thomas with the pass. Hunter nice over. have had a touch net here on midfield. Well, touch net by a Catholic Memorial. And Brian Hunter, senior and captain to serve, tied 10-10 here in game number one. Just got over there. Fortunate for midfield. Thomas Stevenson, uh, there was this tough setup, able to get it over. Bobby O'Reilly, that's what you're looking for out of him. He plays a great center net. And you put that one away wisely. Metfield will take an 11-10 lead. And here's where they need to make a run. Brian Hunter, a great server. They really need to make a statement here. Put some points on the board. Well done by Sean Conroy to keep that alive. And Bobby O'Reilly again. New to the team this year, a senior coming over from the basketball team. Tremendous athlete. Uh, we have four or five of them that came over from the basketball team who are playing volleyball for the very first time. So it's a very uh, interesting year so far. Not quite the success they had hoped, but uh, given that many of them have just started to play for the very first time, they're uh, doing a great job. Again, they need to win four of the next four. Oh, let's see. They didn't even four of the next five games. So uh, this is this is an important night for uh, for Medfield. All right, and here we are back after a timeout. Brian Hunter to serve. Medfield up twelve to ten. Unfortunate positioning on Medfield side there. Randall Miller thought about swiping at it, but just, just over his head, and no one there to get it for Medfield. So uh, CM takes the ball back, trailing 12 to 11. Okay. Nice serve there by Catholic Memorial. However, I don't know what the ruling is there. Ball to Medfield. Could have been a touch net. Bobby O'Reilly for Medfield to serve with a two-point lead. 
Nice looking serve. He's really worked on that serve this year. It's a terrific double block by Carter and Collada. Once again, two first time players, first year players, seniors, coming in from the basketball team, adding a lot of excitement to the team this year. Bobby O'Reilly with the pass. Well saved there by Catholic Memorial. I think they've got four touches on that. Oh, no, they're calling a double hit. And Bobby O'Reilly to serve. He's got an interesting serve. It's got a little bit of a curve to it. Nice pass by Bobby O'Reilly. Keep that alive. Nick just gets it over. Ooh. A little bit of a miscommunication there on the front and back courts. Ball drops between a couple of players. Well played by Carger to get that over. Looks like we have touch net. On Catholic Memorial, Medfield to take over 15 to 12. And I will say that uh, Medfield has not showed what they can do here tonight. They're not playing to their highest level. They've played against much better opposition and done much far better. Well played by... Well played by both sides there. Nicolata wanted to spike that one home, but uh, was in just an awkward position, couldn't do it. Catholic Memorial takes the point and the ball. Nicely done by Jack Maddy. Yet another addition to the team. First year player, sophomore, also a basketball player from Medfield High. Thomas Stevenson serving. Missed opportunity there by midfield. Ball came over fairly slow, but I think there was a miscommunication there. Catholic Memorial to serve down two here in game number one. Thomas takes control. Well played by Hunter to get that over. Bobby O'Reilly with the pass. Jay Carter with the set. Thomas Stevenson with the over. what the call is here. I have to say, as an objective observer, that I believe the midfield boy, uh, Jack Matty, hit the net on that pretty obviously, but they fortunately didn't get the call. Randall Miller here with the serve. Well played by midfield there. Nice spike by Bobby O'Reilly. Randall Miller with the pass. Hunter, terrific. Terrific spike. May have been going out of bounds, but it was tipped off of a CM player. Too much to handle. He brings a lot of uh, excitement to the team, Brian, Brian Hunter. Tall and athletic. Oh, Jake Carter had that. He, was, he mistimed his jump. Unfortunate for Medfield there. Good save by... Uh, Brian Hunter there, but uh, Carger unable to come up with the hit. CM to serve. Bobby O'Reilly. I know that's what uh, Coach Hastings is looking for in the center, center net there from O'Reilly, and he's done a great job learning that position. Brand new this year, first time touching the volleyball. Sean Conroy to serve for midfield. Good job by CM to get that over. Well done by Brian Hunter. Nice spike. And they're really starting to put it together now. Sean Conroy is served with a five point lead here in game number one. Coach Hastings was very pleased with that approach. I think he 
he's looking for a little bit more setup. The Catholic Memorial did us a favor and gave us the ball back on the, on the serve. So Brian Hunter to serve now. And that field up five. Serve two hot to handle for Catholic Memorial. And Brian Hunter will now serve 22-16. Brian's brother played here a couple of years ago. Bobby, also a great basketball player. Also had a terrific serve. Good communication there by Matt Field to get that over. Thomas Stevenson there for the dig. Looks like they still need a little work on that, uh, on that play in the center court. Catholic Memorial takes the ball and the serve. Thomas Stevenson didn't have a choice there. He just had to get it over. But there was a missed opportunity to spike the ball there. Oh, no, no, that was on the wrong side. Ooh, that appeared to be on the other side of the net. I'm not sure what that call was, but no one's arguing, so it must be my eyesight. Brian Hunter with a nice pass. Bobby O'Reilly, very athletic play to get that ball over. And he will now serve 23-18 to try to put this game away. And then a couple points here. Well done by Thomas Stevenson, left-handed to get that over. Tough play by Stevenson. He was able to get his left hand on it, make a good play. And now Bobby O'Reilly will serve. Game point here. Game number one. He gets, he gets not a pleasant look from Coach Hastings on that. <laughs> if looks could kill. Ooh, that's out. Oh, my goodness. And this is where Medfield really needs to be better. They really got to put other teams away when they have a chance. And they're just letting this one right back in. Bobby O'Reilly with the dig. Sean Conroy and Nick, nice over there. And they put it away. Not a game Coach Hastings is going to be all that happy with. Not a game Medfield players are going to be happy with, but they, they did what they needed to do to get that game one under their belts. All right, and we're back. Medfield playing Catholic Memorial. They took game number one, 25 to 20. Here we go with game number two. Catholic Memorial starting. Good play by Catholic Memorial to keep that one alive. Nick Collada with a nice play to get that over. Miscommunication on CM side there. And Thomas Stevenson now for Medfield will serve. Medfield up one to nothing in game number two. Once again, they took game number one. And that's four hits on Catholic Memorial, so Medfield will keep the ball and take the point. 2-0 Medfield. Wow, that was a nifty move from Catholic Memorial to get that over. Nice touch by Brian Hunter. Six foot seven, went up for a spike and just gave it a little tap. That's all you needed. Thomas Stevenson to serve for Medfield. Oh, that's unfortunate. We have three tall blockers there, but it just went off on one of their arms and uh, fell softly to the ground. Catholic Memorial now will serve. Metfield leading three to one here in game number two. Metfield call for a double hit there. I think that was uh, Nick Collada, number 36, one of the new players this season, a senior. Catholic Memorial, Thomas Stevenson with the serve, Jake Carter with the set, Nick Collada with the spike. Saved by Catholic Memorial. 
Jay Carger with a set there. Jack Maddy with a second set. Spike by Brian Hunter. Not enough to get the job done. Bobby O'Reilly keeps it alive. And Brian Hunter. Finishes it off with a nice spike. And Randall Miller. Once again, a terrific young talent for the team. Coming off a of JV last year. First year as a varsity player. Thomas Stevenson just gets it over. Good communication by midfield there. Well set up by Jack Maddy. Well done by Bobby O'Reilly to keep that one alive. And good over there by Jack Maddy. Good decision. And this Medfield Gymnasium is very challenging because of the low ceiling. My understanding is that the original plans had a much higher ceiling and someone read the diagram wrong. So we have a, a, lot, a very low ceiling. And it really affects other teams. They can't quite get uh, caught up with it. Nice, terrific spike there. I couldn't catch who that was. I'm going to lose Jack Matty, number 35. Serve Tom Stevenson there with a oh, challenging. Yep, there you go. The ceiling caught and caught uh, midfield. Um, that ball went off off the ceiling too hot and straight down. Catholic Memorial to serve down six to three here in game number two. Well played by CM to keep that alive. Just a missed spike there by uh, Bobby O'Reilly. Medfield by two. Getting some advice there by Jack Hastings. Coach Hastings, of course, won a number of championships here for the girls' team. All right. A little miscommunication there with uh, Jay Carter's foot and Thomas Stevenson's hands. Well played by Bobby O'Reilly. Nice spike. Exactly what you're looking for. Stop the bleeding. Get back to basics. Sean Conroy in for Jack Maddy on the substitution, and he will take the serve as Medfield leads 7 to 5 in here in game number two. Once again, Medfield taking game number one, 20 to 25. Sean Conroy with the serve. Dies as it goes over the net. Uh, one of those soft hits there where a block doesn't quite cut it. If it's not hitting off hard enough, it just falls <laughs> harmlessly to the ground. Catholic Memorial here to serve. Set up. Ryan Hunter with the spike, not enough to get it done. Tom Stevenson with the first touch. Once again, dug out by Thomas Stevenson. Jake Carter with the over. Nice play by Metfield to keep that one alive. That one looked iffy. Just touched as it came over. Tom Stevenson with the dig. Well played. Well played by Sean Conroy there. Noticed the back was wide open and just put it straight out. Brian Hunter to serve. Get a terrific serve, just like his older brother a few years ago, Tom Stevenson. A substantially less skilled team, this Catholic Memorial team. Medfield seems to be playing to their level right now. Well played. Nice placement by Bobby O'Reilly on that one. Saw, saw where the opening was and just tapped it gently there. That's the heads-up play that the coach is looking for, I think. And he will now serve Medfield up by two, nine to seven. Good looking serve. Well saved there by Brian Hunter. It's a terrific dig. 
Uh, unfortunate for Medfield there. Good block by Carger and Collada, but uh, out of bounds. Something the boys have been working on is finding ways to get those block spikes from going out of bounds. It's a skill. It takes time to learn. Collada got that over nice. Just well played. Some, some ugly volleyball here. Wow, terrific save and good by Crockett Memorial, but they couldn't, they couldn't finish it off. Great spike by Stevenson, but uh, terrific dig by Captain Memorial, and they kept it alive, but just couldn't get it over. Fortunately for Medfield, and they'll take it with a uh, two-point lead. Jake Carger, senior, to serve. Into the net. And again, those are, the, those are the little mistakes that the coach is really trying to eliminate from the team as we move closer to the playoffs here. I'm not sure what that call was. It appeared to glance off one of the Catholic Memorial boys before it hit the ground, but uh, tied 10-10. Hey, hey. well, that's just a lack of communication by the team there. No one's talking. The ball well in bounds. And uh, once again, not, not the best effort from midfield here. Well, Catholic Memorial returns the favor, and it's tied 11-11. Captain Thomas Stevenson to serve. Nice double block there by Collada and Hunter. They're forced to be reckoned with. When, when this team's on their game, they can be really, really tough to beat. Haven't seen their best effort yet. Spike attempt there by Catholic Memorial, but out on the far right side. Thomas Stevenson to serve up two. Brian Hunter with the, the spike. It's a great heads up play. Great heads up play by Nick Collada there. Don't assume the spike's gonna kill it. You gotta be ready for anything, and uh, well done there. It was needed. Great play by Catholic Memorial to get that back over. Brian Hunter for the spike. Nice job. That's what this team needs, a little separation from, uh, from Catholic Memorial here. Thomas Stevenson's given some consistent serves to get him in that position. That's what they want to do. They want to get in that rhythm and get it over to the strong side where Brian Hunter has a shot at spiking it. Very challenging to defend against. That field up. Oh. Attempt by Thomas Stevenson there to dig that out, but a uh, little late to the dance, as they say. So we've got Catholic Memorial down four. Again, what they're looking for is get it, get it over to the far side where your tallest players can slam it home. And Brian Hunter has delivered consistently tonight on that front. We've got Randall Miller for the serve for midfield. And a little miss cross up there on the front. Catholic Memorial to serve. Midfield up four. It doesn't work every time, and this time Bobby O'Reilly tried to put him where they ain't, but um, they outsmarted him. And Catholic Memorial's hanging tough, hanging in there. I'm not sure Coach, is, uh, Coach Hastings is very pleased with the effort so far. If I could read facial expressions. Well, 
close and pretty, but midfield got that over. And looking for a safe, a safe over there. And Jake Carter with a nice, nice stroke, but just hit the tape and fell on the midfield side. CM takes the ball. Let's see if we can get a nice spike there by Bobby O'Reilly. That's what they want to do, change it up a little bit too. So uh, Brian Hunter on the far side, ready for the spike, but uh, Bobby O'Reilly taking care of it in the middle. Puts the other team off balance. Worked like a charm. Sean Conroy to serve for Medfield, up three. In game number two, 18 to 15. Nice save there by Sean Conroy, and then a good over by Thomas Stevenson too. You need a sure hand on that one. And Oh, they got the line on that. Terrific block by Bobby O'Reilly and Brian Hunter, and it did hit the line on the way over, so. Terrific double block executed by Metfield there. Sean Conroy will serve Metfield up 19-15, game number two. Straight up in the air to Catholic Memorial. Almost touches the ceiling, and it's out of bounds on the far side. Conroy to serve. Metfield up 20 to 15. And here's where coach really wants them to put the knife in and take this home. Do not let these guys back into the game. Thomas Stevenson with the first touch. Brian Hunter with the just, just get it over. There's no spike on that one. Terrific double block by Carver and O'Reilly there. They're getting more and more comfortable with that block as the season goes on. And if they can continue to improve like that, and they can somehow get into the playoffs. They have a shot. It's not easy adding five new players who have never played the game to a team and going very far in the playoffs, but they have a shot at it. Well played by Randall. Sean Conroy, now we need to get it over. Thomas Stevenson with a nice play there to get that over. Good play all the way around for midfield. Close to a carry there by Brian Hunter, but Carger with the set. Brian, Bobby Hunter, Bobby O'Reilly with the over. Uh, missed opportunity there by Montreal. Well played by Catholic Memorial there. Find the hole in the defense. Terrific hit by Brian Hunter. That didn't look at all spikeable. Bobby O'Reilly, a nifty move to get that. Nice dig there by Randall in the back. Randall Miller, a terrific young player for this team. Well played by Catholic Memorial. Nice, nice spike. Uh, and that field had no answer. Number 19 had a nice hit on that. Catholic Memorial to serve, down 21-17. Bobby O'Reilly thought twice about it, didn't have the height he wanted, so he went with a soft touch, found the floor. Brian Hunter to serve, Metfield up 22 to 17. Game number two, nice, nice line drive serve by Brian, Oak, Brian Hunter, just like his brother. Killer serve when it's on. Straight over the net, knuckles a little bit, hard to, oh, that, another terrific serve. Two straight points, two great serves. Shows the importance of a good serve and also shows the importance of the good first hit, which they've been unable to get on the Catholic Memorial side on those serves. A spike attempt by Brian, Bobby O'Reilly there. Into the net and Catholic Memorial will take the ball. Still game point here, Medfield. Nice save there by Sean Conroy. He gives another. <laughs> Thomas got another opportunity there. Thomas Stevenson, two spikes in a row. First one didn't work, second one worked. And Medfield takes a two games to none lead here in the best of five set against Catholic Memorial. Okay, we're back here. Medfield. 
Warriors Boys Volleyball versus Catholic Memorial. Medfield taking the first two games of this best of five set. First game 25 to 20. Game number two 25 to 18. And we are just about ready to get going here in game number three. Once again, Medfield has five games remaining in the season, and they need four out of those five in order to make the playoffs. Jake Carter starts us off. Terrific looking spike from the back line there by Captain Memorial. Thomas Stevenson has a soft spike. Jake Carter with the set. Nicola, nice job to get that deep into the far zone. And that feels fortunate not to have a tip there on that triple block, but no one touched it, fortunately. And Jake Carter serving Medfield up one to nothing in game number three. Nice dig there by Thomas Stevenson. And he finishes it off with a spike. Great dig and spike by Thomas Stevenson there. Jake Carter to serve. Nicolata. That's what they've been looking for all season as he gets more comfortable out there. He's got the height, he's got the athleticism. It's, this, it's the, uh, the practice on that spike. It's very hard to get that. Uh, Netfield takes, a, uh, takes advantage of a miscommunication by Catholic Memorial there. No one there, and the serve falls to the floor. Jake Carter continues to serve here, up 4 nothing. Bobby O'Reilly with the first touch. Tom Stevenson had no play but to get it over. Well played by Medfield. Showing their athleticism there. Terrific save by Bobby O'Reilly there. And a lot of fun to watch when they can get it on. Catholic Memorial takes over there. Terrific serve. Nicolata with the over. Uh, just a little lack of communication there on CM side. Thomas Stevenson to serve. Metfield up six to one here in game number three. Make that seven to one. Catholic Memorial could not safely play the serve. A little miscommunication issue with Kalata Stevenson there. Interesting, uh, fortunate spike on Catholic Memorial off of Kalata and uh, point to Catholic Memorial. They will serve. Bobby O'Reilly with the first touch. Ryan Hunter couldn't do much with that. He needed to just get it over. And he did. Uh, Metfield really needs to communicate here. There's a couple, a couple of really cross wires. They're fortunate enough to be up 8-2 in this game. And in comes Randall Miller. We got a timeout. I'm not sure who called this timeout. I didn't quite catch that. The way Coach Hastings is talking to his players, it feels like it's more on his side. Randall Miller with the serve from Metfield. Thomas Stevenson with the first touch there. Brian Hunter timing it perfectly. He really has that 
spike down. He worked. He was terrific with it last year, his first time playing. But you can see that extra year of experience has really helped him out. Randall Miller with a very rare, very rare uh, miss serve on that. He is one of the better servers on the team. Great young talent, the sophomore from Medfield. Catholic Memorial to serve. Thomas Stevenson with a very rare poor first hit. Um, what do we have there? I'm not sure what that call was. We're just going to go midfield ball. Could not see what the call on the um, Catholic Memorial there was, but it goes to midfield. Sean Conroy with the serve up 10 to 3. Good looking spike by Catholic Memorial, but Thomas Stevenson able to get it. <laughs> Some nifty play there by Medfield. Catholic Memorial, though, has talent. They're, they don't go away easily. Medfield really has to be careful here. Sean Conroy to serve up 11 to 3. Game number 3. And just as I said a moment ago, number 19 for Catholic Memorial. A couple of real solid spikes. And he will now serve. Well dug out by Randall Miller. That's a good looking spike by Brian and Bobby O'Reilly there. It's a game of momentum, a game of communication, and when it's on, it's on. Brian Hunter now to serve for Medfield up 12-4 in game number three. Thomas Stevenson with the over. No opportunity to spike. It's going to be called double hit. Uh, number 15, I believe, a Catholic Memorial. Brian Hunter again to serve for Medfield up 13 to 4. Nice serve by Brian Hunter. Randall Miller with the first touch. Sean Conroy with the set. Thomas Stevenson with the spike. Well played by Medfield there. I'm not sure who actually hit the ball there between uh, Carger and Bobby O'Reilly. Brian Hunter to serve with a 10 point lead. They're starting to play like you know they can. Attempt to get a quick, quick over there by 15 into the net. And Brian will continue to serve for midfield. He tries a jump serve. Not a bad time to try out a uh, jump serve, see how it's going. It didn't work out for him, but they still have a 10 point lead here in game number three. Catholic Memorial to serve. Thomas Stevenson first touch. Bobby O'Reilly with the spike out on the far side. Point and ball to Catholic Memorial. That's a good eye by Randall Miller, knowing that ball is going out. And he will be substituted for by Nick Collada. Bobby O'Reilly from midfield to serve. They call that an ace. No one touched it. Bobby O'Reilly, his first serve, finds the floor. That field up 17 to 6 here in this game number three. Nick Collada timing the jump perfectly. Again, he's been working on that all year and getting more and more confident as the year's gone on. And if you're a Medfield fan, that is something that is that brings joy to your heart. Jump serve there by Bobby O'Reilly. Four touches on the CM side. Medfield takes another one point, 19 to six. Bobby O'Reilly serving. Ooh. And Brian Hunter thought that was going out just in. And Catholic Memorial to serve. Nicolata with a terrific spike. 
He's feeling it. You can see it with every one. He's gaining confidence. Jake Carger now. Another senior, another terrific basketball player, and another first-year player for Medfield. He will serve with a 15-point lead for Medfield. This is the first time they've actually looked like they've had a comfortable enough lead to start smiling. Bobby O'Reilly with the first touch. Thomas Stevenson. Interesting looking punch there by Medfield. Jake Carger now serving 22 to 6. And he'll try a jump serve, and that looked for real. Not one of Thomas Stevenson's better moments. <laughs> He's having a good laugh. I'm not sure Methiel thought that uh, it wasn't four hits on the Catholic Memorial side, so they kind of all gave up. Methiel serves into the net, and I'm sorry, that's Catholic Memorial serves into the net. Thomas Stevenson will serve for Methiel up 23-7. Well played by Medfield, Jake Carger. That's one, that's one you'd like to have a slow motion replay of. That was well played by Jake Carger there to keep that alive for Medfield. And Thomas Stevenson to serve game and match point here, 24 to seven. Bobby O'Reilly with the first touch, Jake Carger, and he's, Bobby Riley with the over. And that'll do it. Medfield winning game number three, 25 to seven in the best of five set. They triumph over Catholic Memorial here and they take one of those crucial games they need on their path to try to make the playoffs here at the end. This is Chris Stevenson signing off from Medfield TV. Thanks for watching. Production support provided by Medfield.tv. Access to our community.